Hey guys, how are you? Hope you're doing well. I got six books from my library the other day, and they're all off of my to-read shelf on Goodreads. Um, I wanted to pick something that was a little more supernatural, maybe paranormal, anything like that, maybe darker themes. But I also got some for, like, generalized life slash life lessons, because my NaNoWriMo novel is more of a, like, not chiclet, but it's more of a generalized slice of life kind of book. And I don't have a lot of experience with those kind of novels, so I figured I should get some. But I figured I would just say the name of the book and who writes it, and then put links in the description to their Goodreads pages or maybe even author pages so I don't spoil anything because I'm a spoiler queen. So this is probably going to be really, really, really short. But I promise that after I read them all, I will probably give them all a group review instead of individually because I'm terrible at reviews. I'm one of those people that's like, oh, I liked it or I hated it. I'm pretty simple that way. So first I started reading, decided to start reading Joe Hill's Horns. It's got awesome, like, pitchfork. And... I just started, decided to read it first out of all of them because of Anna, Anna Akana's um, book review on here. And I will put her review down in the description. But it's, it's really good so far. I'm about 60, 70 pages in. And look at my awesome Dancing Skeletons bookmark. <laughs> um, next is The Ever After by Amy Huntley. And I think I picked that one because of the cover, honestly. It's a pretty wicked sweet cover. Next is Every Day by David Lethan. I don't know how to say last name. Sorry, guys. But I will say something about that. It reminds me of the plot of one of my favorite books, which is called Doppelganger by... I cannot remember his last name. I will put that book down in the description, too. One of my favorite books, it's my go-to book if I'm having a like book a reading slump I will read that and it just I find something new in it every time and it's amazing so I will put that one down in the description too I got project 17 by Lori Feria Stroltz Stroltzer I am so bad at last names I'm so sorry um sorry guys next is a certain slant of light by Laura Whitcomb and I listened to the audiobook, I think, back when I was in high school, and I did not like it, but me and audiobooks are not friends, so I think I'm going to like it much, much better in book form. And last but not least, I got The Survival Kit by Donna F uh, Friedis? Free yeah, Friedis, I think. And I got that one because it's more generalized life struggles, slice of life finding yourself kind of novel, which is what I need to kind of absorb for my NaNoWriMo novel. And yeah, so I hopefully will read all of these instead of like dropping them like I do most books. And I will probably do a group review, like I said. I will leave all the links in the description for the books, the one I mentioned, um, Doppelganger, and Anna Akana's book club review of either Just Horns or her entire book reviews, which she also does like plays and graphic novels, which is really awesome. And I think that's it. Um, have a great day and love you guys. Bye!